Hey everyone, today is my Aldi grocery haul. Um, I'm going to give you my grocery budget update too. Uh, this is the last week of April for me, so the last week of April's budget, which is €280. Euro. So for a four-week month, uh, it is €280. Euro. For a five-week month, it is €350. Euro. Um, so let's see how we get on. I'll show you my grocery haul and I'll give you my update at the end. Okay, so we'll start with the freezer stuff. Home style chips, 87p at the moment. Two of those chicken balls. I love the chicken things from Aldi, they're really tasty. 28 cent for garlic baguette, seriously good value. And then 2.15 for of those beef quart pounders. I'm gonna do burger in a bowl with those. It's gonna be pizza at the weekend. We're gonna to top those with extra pepperoni, extra cheese, extra peppers. 2.39 for four, absolute bargain. 99 cent each for the potato waffles and then we've got a couple of packets of sausage rolls to put away in the fridge over the weekend and maybe one in the freezer they are nice for like a handy breakfast or a lazy breakfast really beautiful cheese that i cannot eat because i'm lactose intolerant but we have it in the house for the kids brazil nuts this is what i snack on this and this um they are about 2.29 i think they would last me about a month 99 cents for six kiwis, 2.49 for the strawberries, which look absolutely delicious. I got the better quality ham because last time I bought ham, it ended up in the cat. I've got to stop doing that. I've got to stop buying cheap ham. So these were not as good as I thought they were when I picked them up. So I'm going to cut them and put them away and use them quickly. Lettuce. Special offer this week. I'm thinking 49 cent. I'll check in a minute. 199 for the rashers, and then I got more expensive sausages this week because the cheaper ones seem to spike my blood sugar. I'm assuming they have more carbohydrates in them. Then I got some courgettes for various meals across the week: tomatoes, eggs, and oh yes, the kidney beans. I've got three of those. Got my coffee. Got three of those. And then I got these two, so little treat for the press. So they're 149 each. This has gone up again to 187. It was 150 last year sometime. It went up to 165 and it's been on the rise since. Special offer in Aldi this week, 250 for chickadees. Water is still the same price at 129. Um, and then these were 150 in super value. I didn't see a special offer sticker, but I think that's a special price special offer price for Pringles. That was one that was requested by one of the kids for the weekend. Lovely juice in Aldi, 149 for those. And then I couldn't find sparkling water in Aldi, so I got a six pack of sparkling water in Super Value and they cost me 185. Now they're one liter rather than 1.5 liter, but it's still very good value. I would say equal to Aldi's price. On those so that's this week's grocery haul um if you're enjoying this guys would you just give it a like pop a comment in the comments below if there's anything you'd like to know um or just say hi and if you're enjoying this and would like to see more please think about subscribing as it really helps out my channel thank you with what i've got today along with what's in the freezer Today we're going to have a pasta, chicken and salad. The pasta is already made because I batch cooked it during the week. I won't have that obviously because I'm eating low carbs. So I'll be having chicken and salad. Then tomorrow there will be a large curry made uh, with rice and roasted vegetables. The roasted vegetables are for me. I will show you those at some stage. They're absolutely delicious. And the same again Saturday. And then pizza on Sunday. I'm going to use those pizzas that I bought today in Aldi. But I'm going to top them with extra cheese and extra toppings, ham, pepperoni, etc. And then on Monday, burger bowls. And on Tuesday, chicken and chips. And then on Wednesday, fish and veggies. And then our week starts again on Thursday. So that's the meals of the week. This is my um, tracker. I use this for different categories. But for the grocery, um, so I set up the projected amount of 1820 for six months. And so far we've spent fifteen nine sorry thirteen ninety four nearly fourteen hundred over one two three four months, which is an average of three fifty a month I think off the top of my head, which is still not bad, but it's more than I would have wanted to spend um and I'd like to pull it back if I could. We'll see what happens in May. I do have a huge amount of stuff in the freezer, 
uh, and I have plenty of things under the stairs, which is my little pantry. So let's see, I might be able to pull it back. Anyway, if you're enjoying all of this, please give us a like, subscribe so that you don't miss out on all of the grocery budget and meal planning fun. And I will talk to you the next day. Thanks for watching. Bye.